Welcome to the new Doctor's Lottery. For six years, you've been playing the game. Every essay, exam, has led to this moment at this table. Your future is now out of your hands. A single shuffle, a turn of the cards, will decide the next two years of your life. Hi, my name's Dan. I'm a final year medical student at the University of Oxford and I wanted to start my training in London. My name's Karen and I wanted to go to Oxford for uh, F1. I'm Junaid and I would like to start training as a doctor in Birmingham. I'm Vif and I wanted to start training in Oxford. Are you ready to play this game? So I got my third choice, which was Kent, Surrey, Sussex. It's tricky, a little disappointed, but overall reasonably happy. So I got my sixth rank. I got placed in Wales. What was your reaction when you first got the news? Um, I guess initially quite shocked. Um, I think as time's gone on, I'm a bit more comfortable with it. I wouldn't say I'm happy, but you know, just sort of coming to terms with it, I guess. I got given my first choice of Birmingham. Just felt super lucky uh, and grateful that I got given my, my first place. I got placed bottom of the ballots, so my last preference, which is Northern Ireland. It was like having a, a pit in my stomach. Uh, it was hard to believe at first, um, and I genuinely thought it was a mistake. Yeah, I was physically shaking, feeling really anxious as well. Can you describe your experience of this allocation system in one word? I'd say confusing. I'm a bit confused about why the system is the way it is, why we can't really know our rank um, within it. Um, so I think that would help us sort of make more informed decisions. The system that had been in place previously had been there for a long, long time. And so throughout medical school, I've been working towards basing my application on those things. And then to suddenly be told sort of six months beforehand that the system was changing was, was quite difficult to, to handle. Seeing the reactions of my peers around me, who have got choices ranging from second, third, fourth, all the way down to 18th choice out of 18 in some cases, I feel very lucky that I've been given um, the place I actually wanted to go to. A living nightmare. I know it's two words, but I'll go with that. <laughs> Has the experience changed your feeling about starting work as a doctor? Definitely. I think at the moment, um, I've, I've decided to take a year out rather than going ahead with the Northern Ireland job. Being a doctor is hard enough as it is, especially in your first year, and I think it's important to be in an environment where you feel comfortable in. And I'm not saying that Northern Ireland is a bad place, but it's a place where I've never been to. Um, it's a place where I don't know anyone. Um, I don't even know where within Northern Ireland I'd be. I know lots of people who are unhappy in this system because they've, they feel like they've had no sort of um, say in, in where they're being placed at the end of the day. Where are you going to be spending the next two years?